Yo guys, what is going on? Welcome back to a brand new video of WWE Supercard episode 179. In today's episode, we've got a lot of things to do. Seth Rollins from the RTG, King of the Ring update, and then possibly getting the reward of that King of the Ring later on in this episode. But the main thing I want to do in this episode, guys, is open some more Hall of Fame packs. Now, before all of you, because I this is something that I wanted to talk about really quickly, and that is why I open a lot of packs, and you guys were like, oh, but he's made of money. No, I'm really not. I really enjoy this game. This is like the main game I spend money on, and if that's what I want to do with it, then I think, I should, yeah, I think that's okay. Not, not, not yeah. Anyway, um, James is with me on the Discord, so how you doing, man? I'm doing fun. So and he has what? guaranteed me that I'm going to get Eddie Guerrero from a pack that if he's in the Discord with me. So I'm going to take him on his word. But if I don't get Eddie Guerrero from the first pack, he has to delete his entire catalogue in Supercard. Isn't that right? <laughs> no, I'm just no. joking, guys. But we are going to open a pack. It will be the first thing we do. Because, um, you know, I don't, I don't want you... I don't want to get you all hyped and make you guys wait 20 minutes. So, yeah, we're going to open a Hall of Fame pack. If we got a WrestleMania card, that'd be sick. They are on sale. That's why I'm choosing to do this now. I'm going to open one, maybe two, but probably just one. Three, two, one. All right, guys, click. All right, um, that's decent. I mean, it's, it's, not, it's not a WrestleMania, but it's an ultimate. It's an ultimate, ultimate warrior. What, oh, you know, I was just about to say. What, isn't it what can I say? What can I say? Um, yeah, not worth the credits, but I'm pretty sure that's a pro. Let me cool. con let me confirm that that is a pro. It's not. What? Please, Are you telling me I haven't gone on my warrior? What? Please. You deleted it. No, there's no way I would delete it. I'm not. I I don't do those kind of things. Let me uh let me have a look in the catalog if I've already got him proed. Ultimate, we're looking for Ultimate Warrior, so he'll be probably at the end. Not probably, most definitely at the end. Oh, there's a Ric Flair in Ultimate here, sick. Uh, Ultimate Warrior, okay, wow. So I didn't have him before, I didn't have him before, and I didn't get him pro so he's now locked in. Okay, not bad. We'll open another one, guys, because I think you guys deserve it. You guys have been so supportive recently on the channel. I'm gonna bring you guys another pack. I'm just, it's an excuse. I just really want to open another one. Three, two, one. Please be like an Eddie Guerrero or a Macho Man or a Mick Foley. WrestleMania 33. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I got so trolled. I thought that WrestleMania is clearly an enhancement or like a support, but we got a Booker T. That is a pro, but it's hardened. So fuck oh. that, but yeah, let's have a look who this, what this WrestleMania. It's probably an enhancement, isn't it? No oh yes, that what? makes up for it, one hundred percent. Get in, guys. WrestleMania sensational Sherry. She is compatible with Freddy Blassie. Oh, that is brilliant. Brilliant. I'm really happy with that. That is, it's insane how managers made me really happy. Compatible managers, I should say. Um, just best let me just make sure really quickly that I, I am I am speaking the truth here. Um, power, charisma, toughness, speed. Yeah, sick. All right, I'll take that. Um, are we going to open another pack? We're going to open another pack. No, we're not. We're not. Oh, are we? Okay, last, I can't believe I'm opening three packs when I said I'm going to open maybe one. I always do this. I always say I'm going to do, open like, okay, we're going to open one more. We're probably, come on, please. <laughs> it's too late now. I've already done it. I've already clicked on it. Give me a WrestleMania, boys. <sighs> Ultimate He's Diamond good. Dallas Page. Elite Bobby Heenan and a WrestleMania Speed. Wow, okay. Is Diamond Dallas Page a pro, though? D -D he is. He is a pro. Yes, I'll take that. Combine. Yes, please. And Booker T is also a pro. Combine. Yes, please. Okay, so we got two pros out of that. We got a compatible manager 
for like all my decks now. It's great. I would have preferred a Jimmy Hart because I like using the pairing of Paul Heyman and Jimmy Hart more than I do Freddie Blassie and Sensational Sherry. But at this point, I'm not really going to pick. I opened three packs. Um, again, a lot of credits, but they are on sale. Yeah, wasn't really worth it because we didn't get a WrestleMania card, but I hope you guys did enjoy that. Drop this video a like for those three packs. Thank you, James, for being here. You didn't get me that Eddie Guerrero luck, so I, 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 fuck I'll you delete. if I'm joking. <laughs> I'll, I'll delete a card. Nah, you don't have to delete anything, man. It's not your fault. No. Super God's fault. Anyway, guys, thank you for watching. Uh, I'll be right, literally, for you guys, it'll be like three seconds. But for me, I'm going to go to sleep first. And then I'll be back with some Seth Rollins RTG. And uh, the, uh, pro like, probably the, you know, once this is done, the King of the Ring. But like a sneak little preview of how everything's going. It's game number 36. And I'm 29 and 6. Um, doing really well, actually. And I'm currently first by a little bit. Like, you know, it's not, it's quite close between me and Jonathan. Jonathan potentially wants to join the team as well. He's really friendly, so shout out to him. Uh, shout out also to Dead Silence. Um, yeah, they, they're nice, and this King of the Rings is cool. Good luck to everyone who's in it. Uh, as long as I can get to the semi-finals, I don't really care what's going on. I don't really care if I win or not, as long as I can get to the semis. All right, guys, I'll be right back with some RTG and some King of the Ring and some Battleground and all of that good stuff. See you in a sec. Alright guys, what's going on? Welcome back to episode 179. We have got a couple things to do in the second part, and uh, well, well, let's, what should we start off with? Uh, Battleground, yeah, let's show you guys Battleground. Um, got four attacks left. Now, a lot... Uh, it, it's not good, it's not good. Very disappointing from a couple people. Fatboy, uh, no charges. Flame, no charges. And Real Gamer Girl, no charges. So we're going to see what we're going to do. Might be time to get rid of some people in the team. Who knows? But uh, we'll talk to them. You know, maybe it's just, again, lack of motivation, waiting for a new tier. We've also got King of the Ring and uh, Road to Glory. We'll start off with a game of Road to Glory because, as usual, I kind of leave it to the end. I've got two more games left to play. I'm going to play one game now. We're going to get my King of the Ring rewards uh, and then we'll play another game. So for King of the Ring, I'm not going to spoil yet what we did in it, so yeah, you guys will have to wait to see that. Female tag, let's go with the Baileys. <clears throat> so yeah, um, RTG, not bad, I did really well for once, it wasn't complete like mayhem, panic, the reason is like I just didn't have any work, I'm still awful weather here, almost a week now, just bad weather. That's kind of a it's kind of a bad thing, but hopefully, uh, hopefully the good weather can kick in soon again. But yeah, that means I've just got a lot of time off right now. That's why it was so easy. RTG it was quite quick. Now after this RTG, who knows what's next? Will we have a new tier? Will we have a new update before, or will there just be another event card in WrestleMania 33 tier? Let me know what you guys think because it's. You know, it's quite, you know, lots of people have their opinions. I think if they would have brought out a new tier, they would have done it in the last update. They didn't. They did bring fusions and Hall of Fame and all of that. So what I'm like, the only, the thing is, I'm like, uh, are they going to bring out a new tier? I'm so, I was so confident for so long that they were going to bring out a new tier. And I'm starting to realise, to think about it at least. Um, they brought out like these Hall of Fame packs, the throwbacks and the fusions like, a week ago, a week and a half now, I don't even know, but not long. Um, and if they were to bring out a new tier, that would just be so pointless because, yeah, everyone who's opened those packs and it's just, yeah, lot, that, would, that would be bad. So that makes me think that maybe we're going we're gonna to be stuck for for quite a while. Oh, wow, throwback Jeff Hardy Pro. Now, I haven't seen one of those cards yet. Event cards are better. I've said it, I've said it in an, an episode not long ago, but... It, it goes like this, it goes like the normal pros, normal cards, then it goes fusions, then it goes throwbacks, then it goes Hall of Fame, then it goes event cards. So if you're like hesitating between throwbacks or between Hall of Fames, well I'd honestly go with the Hall of Fames. They're cheaper, number one, and two, they are better than the throwbacks. Now the only thing that is a bit different is the throwbacks are from Elite to WrestleMania and the Hall of Fames are from Harden to WrestleMania, so it is harder but they are better, nicer card design, I think, as well. Just overall better. 
Um, <clears throat> okay, first game is over there. Pretty cool. Uh, we're going to be able to plus 10 this pretty, pretty easily. And yeah, let's go. Let's get my King of the Ring rewards. Please. Please give me something good. Now, it is time to show you guys, like, I haven't made it to the final. I got semi bumped. I know, I know, what a shame. Um, let me show you quickly the games. Let's see if... Alex, Alex is one up in the final, wow. Oh, uh, well, okay, cool zero. Uh, wow, it's number four and number six in the final. Wow, okay. So, yeah, again, I shouted um, them out kind of in the beginning of the episode, but yeah, everyone was really nice in this. Um, Alex, well, I don't think he chatted at all in the chat, but yeah, he did really well. Got into the semi-finals, I was like really confident, you know, I, I don't know why, I was though, I really was. Uh, he goes 1-0 up, goes 2-0 up, and then this happened, and I was like, what the fuck? I had no idea, this has never happened to me before, uh, and it ended on 4-2, and I was like, what the fuck? 4-2? And then this one ended on 4-2 as well, so what a, oh no, is this the, not the one that ended on 4-2? Wait, no, no. I think, okay, only one of them. That was 4-1, okay. So yeah, 4-2 and then 4-1. But it was really weird when I saw 4-2, I was like, that's not possible. But apparently when you draw, you get each a point. So that's that's that. Um, so you could technically draw every single match, actually. That, that I've never seen that. Anyway, so we did lose, but we're going to get our, our rewards. Good luck to the guys in the final. We'll see. Uh, I wonder who's going to win it, but can't really be bothered to find out. We're just going to claim our rewards. 3, 2, 1... Oh, I thought that could have been that could have been Bobby Roode. Oh, you guys know. Okay, so we're looking for Bobby Roode, Big E, Dana Brooke, Sasha Banks, and Nikki Bella. Those are all the ultimates I need. Wow, okay. <laughs> no, no, there's just not you can just doubt it was not gonna give it not gonna give it to me. I don't know why I can't get a Bobby Roode. Can't get Bobby Roode. Okay, so yeah, I suppose I'll buy one title match so we don't have to play two games. Just get it over and done with. Now, play the last game and then we'll end the episode there. Now, um, obviously it's a day after, but in this video you guys did see the pack opening. I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, obviously no WrestleMania cards from it, which is a bit disappointing. But overall, we, we did okay. Um, we got some ultimates, got some pros, and... Like, yeah, my main goal, obviously, is to get a WrestleMania, is make those pros, and that will, they will make my deck. Obviously, that's what I want. But, if I can't get that, then I'm looking just to get my catalogue, just get, like, get some stuff for the catalogue, get cards I haven't gotten before. And we got a couple pros there, so I can't be too upset with it. We got a Sensational Sherry, which is actually going to help me out quite a lot. Um, so yeah, it's, it was okay. Um, I, I definitely hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, will I do more pack openings in the future? The only thing I really like, I, I keep saying to myself, yeah, I really want to open these Hall of Fame cards. I really want a Hall of Fame Pro. Sick card design. Wrestlers I really like who haven't been in the game yet. People like Eddie Guerrero. Um, like, I don't know, that Mick Foley's pretty cool. There's a Bret Hart. There's a, I'm not, I know a couple of those definitely have been in the game. There's Shawn Michaels. But, like, then Sensational Sherry could be awesome to get. And there are just other cards in the other tiers. But they are they're, they're expensive. Um, as soon as a new tier comes out, they're going to be, like, just no... There's going to be, like, literally no point to them. And it's a lot of money. So, what? I, I don't know, guys. I'm not making any promises of opening any more of those. Because uh, I'm, like, addicted. You guys know I'm addicted to these, but... Yeah, uh, as I said in the last, or the, actually no, I said it in the beginning of this video. Um, I'm not made of money. I don't, I don't have all of this money to spend, and I shouldn't be spending all this money on SuperCard. But I do because I love it, and I am kind of addicted to opening packs. And I think you, that's obviously what you guys want to see the most. So when they bring out new stuff, I kind of feel compelled to do it. But now that you know it's over, we did the pack openings. We did like two, three of them plus this one now, so like two or three. I think that's enough. We can kind of leave it at that. And then maybe in the future we can come back to these packs or other packs when a new tier or a next update comes out. But I think we'll leave it at this. So yeah, um, yeah, I think so. I think we, yeah, I think we did enough packs. Unfortunately, no pro, but a couple pictures I'm really happy about that. Eddie Guerrero mainly. Uh, Macho Man is cool. Mick Foley that was cool as well. Not bad at all. Anyway, there we go, guys. We have just got 2K18. Special card design, Seth Rollins event card. Pretty damn sick, actually. That is a pretty sick card. Got six picks on the board. Imagine if we could get our pull right now. That'd be pretty cool. 
Can we get a pull live on camera? It's been a while since that's happened. Last pull was Paul Heyman. It came out of like nowhere. Wasn't even expecting. I was like, did I just pull WrestleMania card? And I knew it was a support, so I was like, oh. and I was like, oh, I think it was Paul Heyman though, and it was, it was. <clears throat> but yeah, really, the only WrestleManias we're looking for now is like Sami Zayn, Brian Kendrick, Neville, um, Kevin Owens, Roman Reigns. And, like, John Cena. I think that's pretty much it. But anyway, there's Seth Rollins, guys. That is fucking awesome. Really, really happy with that. Let's go into our combinables. Lock him down. We've also got that Seth Rollins, as you guys can tell. God, that picture looks... That card looks so cool. I can't wait to get these pro Can't wait to get some more Joe pro as well. Um, and pretty much after that, guys, if you look at my... Uh, at, this, at this deck, for example, you get Seth Rollins in here. <laughs> it's such a good deck, like such a good ring dom deck. Almost full event card, to be fair. And then, and then this uh, Seth Rollins will replace Bobby Roode. Samoa, well, Samoa Joe will replace Bobby Roode. Seth will replace Chris Jericho. My worst card in my RTG deck will now be the phenomenal one, AJ Styles, which is the biggest thing I regret from the. Uh, the glitch, the uh, debug menu with all of that, that I didn't get the picture with the title on from his Money in the Bank one, No Mercy, I think, with Dolph Ziggler. That's the thing I regret the most, I think. So, yeah, but what what else? What, you know, it's it's all right, I suppose. That's pretty cool. But, yeah, guys, my deck's looking my deck's looking great. I'm ready for a new tier. Please give me that new tier. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys have enjoyed it. If you guys have smashed a like on it really appreciate that and subscribe if you're new i'll see you guys tomorrow for a brand new video so then take care and peace out